Hey chess lovers, welcome back to the chess yard. This is Dhaira Bagga and today I'll be playing the final blitz on Lee Chess and during the game I'll try to be as instructive as possible like always, making sure that there's something to be taken away as a learning that helps you improve your game to the next level. Now before I start with the game, I request you to subscribe to my channel and press on the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of the videos that I'm posting up daily without a miss. So yeah, let's start with the game and see how it goes. Got the white pieces. I'll play the London system setup. Starts off with d4, bishop on f4. I was going way beyond. Uh, can play pawn to e3. Open develops the bishop. So should I offer him exchange or develop the knight first? Let's go with knight. Um, now I can offer as well if he really wants to take. Oh, he gets the knight in between. Pawn forward deflects him, but doesn't do me a great favor too. I can go up as well. Let me just play pawn forward and build up on the back. Um, have to take here. Knight in between and he plays pawn forward and then suddenly I'm out of nowhere. So I take this, takes back with the queen mostly, which means a check is possible. I play pawn forward straight away. Uh, there can be some tactics. No, there's no tactic here right now. I double up. Goldman knight in the center maybe. Not now. Can go with pawn forward, looks always tempting. Let's go. Um, can push forward. Makes the space. Can go for a pawn break instead. That can be helpful too. Oh, he doesn't break. I can go here, I can take. Taking can be bad, he takes with the bishop and suddenly, uh oh. Uh, okay, I think I should just move out of the harm's way first. So that there's no bishop threat happening. Get spawn forward. Okay, I'll take you. Uh, I have to take here mostly. Yes, I have to. Takes and then he takes is a problem. He takes, I take is a problem. If I get my knight out, that should be fine. I can take back with the queen. Preparing to castle as well. He just keeps building on pressure. You'll have to take some point of time and it better be right now. I'll take. If he takes with the queen, I'll take the queen as well. Takes with the pawn instead, thankfully. Let's castle. Rook lift coming for sure. How much is the question? This looks fine. Can get the other rook too. Now you cannot play pawn forward because I have this rook attacking the pawn. So gets the other rook in front and so do I. He does take back. I can take this pawn as well. Yeah, it looks nice to me. Closing my rook's range but he comes down, attacks the pawn. There's no defenses is what is worrying me and that's the base of my pawn chain. Uh, but instead if I go here, I can also take his. Hmm, that can be interesting ideas. So which pawn should I take? Or I should take with the rook is the question. Um, let's not take with the rook maybe. Not very keen on taking with the rook. Takes this, I can take this, or maybe I can go here. Maybe sign this. 
uh, that's a free no that's not a free pawn that's a temptation for a free pawn which you should never take <laughs> his idea is if i do take he he gets his rook active and then suddenly i'm running for waters attacking the other pawn instead if he gives a check from somewhere i can just simply move not from here i can take attacking his pawn so he defenses he can come here and i need to stop it too but maybe i can play pawn forward as a challenging thing nah let's not spoil it how is pawn forward pressure comes down maybe doesn't um let's move the king maybe oh he's attacking the pawn simultaneously smart move now i'm defensing and i'm attacking the pawn i can take here yeah why not because this is nice okay exchanging queens of the board good for me i would say i go here trying to take on the pawn if he just tries to move if he plays this forward i'm going here okay let's go up let's go sidestep attacking the pawn exchanges the rooks interesting he's he'll be losing this end game I don't see him winning this unless he finds something out of it. If he goes here, I take this. I'm playing pawn forward. Okay, I'll take here. Okay. Did you want to race? Just need to defend this once, which is stopped already. And he sees that coming. I'll go here. Does take, I'll take back. Go ahead. Go here. Two pawns versus a lone king. I'm not losing this. And I think this time should be enough to get two queens on the board and check my temp. Or maybe even with one. get the queen cut off his diagonals and ranks slowly move with the king towards the king just trying to pre-move stuff here Go down. <laughs> Stalemate. I have to be careful here. I have to go here first. Ah, stalemates are annoying. 
especially when you're winning it. Huh, just one bad move and it's stalemate. He went here. I had to just get my king up. He goes there, check, goes down and mate. I didn't. Time pressure. Stalemates are hurtful. Especially when you're winning. Uh -huh. Disappointed a lot. Need to learn this that I don't stalemate whenever I'm in pressure on time. I just came too close. I have to make a distance. Huh. See. And then it was stalemate with one bad move. I had to give space for the king to move any of these squares so I cannot get my king uh, to the b3. So I had to move on c3 instead. I was playing fast enough on time, had 5-6 seconds remaining on the clock, should have won it. Okay, I'll improve next time. Um, I hope you like the video, do let me know your feedback, keep watching and sharing, do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and come back tomorrow again to see some interesting video. Thank you so much for your time, take care, bye bye.